combine WhatsApp and Skype and what you get is the newest app, Glide. Uh, with us on Intertech is Sarah Snow. Sarah works for Glide. Uh, what does Glide do? Glide is the world's first and only live video messenger. And what that means is you can send your friends videos that they can view live in real time or whenever it's convenient for them. You can also have group chats with up to 50 people. So it's a lot of fun. Yeah, it sounds like a lot of fun. Um, is this the future uh, that we stop text messaging but only use video messaging? Oh, definitely. This is the closest you can feel like actually being with someone in digital communication that you can get because when you talk to someone and you send them um, a video message on WhatsApp, for instance, you have to first record the video and then upload it and then your friend has to download it and by the time they see it, um, the response time can take up to like 10 minutes. So with Glide, since you get the responses instantly, it's almost like having a real conversation with your friends. And when you're comparing it to WhatsApp or Skype, what's, what's the difference? Well, like I said, um, on WhatsApp, you have, it's a video attachment, meaning you have to first record the video on your native camera app, and then you have to upload it, and then your friend has to download it, which eats up a lot of memory on your phone and your data plan. Um, and on Skype, um, a Skype video call also uses up a lot of bandwidth. Skype calls are really meant for um, really good um, network connection and Glide uses around half the data as a video call and the videos don't take up any space in your device since they're all stored in the cloud. So you can send as many videos as you want and not worry about um, memory on your phone or your data plan. Yeah, so a lot of people uh, left WhatsApp because it was bought by Facebook and were afraid of privacy issues. Um, what's Glide's privacy like? So Glide is a private messenger. Um, and since it's, a, since it's a private messenger, no one looks at any of the messages being sent. Um, and that's something that we take very seriously. Now we heard that it's also very popular amongst the deaf community. Yeah, because Glide is the best way to communicate visually. And deaf people that speak sign language, they can't call each other. And talking to each other on Skype and FaceTime requires both people to be locked into a conversation. And since English isn't their first language, sign language is, texting isn't very personal for them. So Glide is really the best and most convenient way for them to communicate with each other. Thank you very much, Sarah. I like Glide a lot. And if you guys like it as well, you can download it on iOS and Android. And don't forget to like us on Facebook, Interconnection.